Shalabaka Prada Katabala Daba. Make sure you are praying. Kam Prada Kabala Daba Shata Paradaba. Lam Brete Kaparada Baladaba Kata Prada Kashele Balada. Kam Posa Tabala Kapris Kabala Karia Dabala Daba. Let's see some facts about destiny clear. Number one, facts about destiny. Every man was born for a reason. Every man, this is the first point I want you to know tonight. Every man, those who serve the great and the great, every man, according to God's predeterminate counsel, every man was born for a reason. I don't care how you came whether it was as a result of one harlot meeting another man is irrelevant hallelujah one more time say i have a destiny what you are saying is i have a predetermined future say i'm not a biological accident i know many of you are used to it. just say it we are going on a journey tonight every man was born for a reason your purpose for existence is the problem you were created to solve. The solution that God put in you to reveal to your world. Your purpose in life. What problem were you created to solve? What solution? Look around the world. We are benefiting from solutions that have been provided to mankind men and women walked upon the earth in ministry in every area of life and they offered solutions to their generations what generation are you from are you getting blessed tonight so number one every man was born for a reason debunk that demonic statement that you do not have a destiny i don't care what has happened to you I don't care what Satan has told you. Can I tell you something? Even the herbalists and the native doctors and those who sell their soul to the devil have a destiny and a purpose in Christ. Hallelujah. Fact number two. Your destiny has been predetermined by God. Your destiny is not an ambition. Your destiny is not an ambition. An ambition is a desire, a craving of something or someone you want to become that's not destiny your destiny has been predetermined listen to me but it takes your choices and decisions to enter into it or lose it your destiny has been predetermined by God but it is a sum total of your choices in life and the decisions that you take he said i set before thee this day blessing and cursing life and death but here's my advice he said what choose life choose life so that you may live fact number three destiny can be aborted this is the painful thing about destiny destiny can be aborted in other words god can earmark someone's life and the man comes here on earth spends 70 years 80 years even a hundred years or more and not locate his destiny at all not even leave it may god forbid that any one of us will just walk through the earth and be a liability to this generation hallelujah destiny is an important thing listen let me tell you something when you find your place in destiny that's where your blessing is that's where your relevant is there is no competition it's a realm that only you exist you see the reason why many people fight tear themselves do everything they do not even know that they have a predetermined future and if they do they don't even know how to get there and tonight my job is to guide us into not just an understanding but an experiential walking the price i made up my mind long time ago that my generation will hear my voice when i said that you were not there when i said that nobody was there but today by the grace of god hallelujah 